Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on December 22nd, 2022. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet. Welcome to a video update here from Daily Events Worldwide, giving you an update on our polar vortex. This is what our polar vortex looks like right now in the Northern Hemisphere, as, as it has amplified and early Noting here the wind speeds at 10,000 feet, 275 kilometers an hour, heading straight across the North American continent. We've got a vigorous, dangerous, cold, low-pressure system that is underneath that. Having a look at temperatures at 10,000 feet, minus 81 degrees Celsius, and that is pushing some very extreme cold temperatures as far south as Mexico, I'm sure in some states, will be breaking records. Minus 40, parts of northern BC, Alberta, minus 44 with the wind chill yesterday. Minus 29 towards central states. And as well, northern Canada, minus 25. And that's going to be sweeping eastward where the very vigorous low pressure system in that. So we are expecting a very dangerous winter storm here right through Christmas. But I wanted to give you guys a heads up here as this could be a sign of things to come. We are only the second day of winter. The winter solstice has begun and the polar vortex is set up in a way where it could be devastating for the Northern Hemisphere. As well as all of the SO2 and ash that erupted from Mauna Loa this year. And Hunga Tonga in the Southern Hemisphere. But we are definitely on the verge of some great changes on our planet heads up because this a low pressure system that's heading across North America quite possibly may have already whipped into the Atlantic Ocean having a look at a thousand feet the winds there's that low pressure system central mid United States winds coming across Washington, Oregon, 198 kilometers at that level. Atmospheric river of moisture stretched right across the Pacific Ocean, as, in, as noted in last night's video. But the pressure is really starting to build. You can see that little blue dot in the middle of North America as things are about to change big low pressure center east pacific pressure is building along the equator a little look at the southern hemisphere versus the northern as the polar vortex has set up in the northern hemisphere quite a drastic change and difference from the southern hemisphere right now Let's have a look at the last seven days of satellite imagery showing all of the lows tracking across North America. Big systems in the East Pacific. Now watch as we have this outflow that is coming from the Pacific. Creates a mesocyclone right about there and then heads eastward. We've also got a low that's tracking southward through BC and Alberta and then that quickly gets ushered towards the Hudson Bay then we've also got the low pressure system coming out of the South Pacific or Central Pacific over Mexico and that's brought some extreme weather towards Florida but this low heading through Colorado right now is a very cold one and it was this low pressure system here, East Pacific, 
made landfall on the 20th, or sorry, on the 18th. And it was, as I said, quickly ushered the center of the low straight into the Atlantic, as you can see here on satellite imagery. The grand solar minimum is real and it is upon us. Solar cycles dictating, solar winds dictating our weather across the planet. Minus 30 in parts of Colorado. This is all Celsius. We're sitting at about minus 8 right now. Watch for that to drastically change over the next 48 hours. Flash freeze will be in effect. Minus single digits through Texas and as well northern Mexico. Stay tuned for the next update coming tonight. Give you a full world update on space weather, earthquakes, volcanoes, and world weather. But I wanted to give you guys a heads up. This could be a sign of things to come. Early and strong, a polar vortex. The velocity is insane. Watch for more colder temperatures to be swirling around here as we just started winter. Please, if you enjoyed this video, like and share. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your daily due. We'll see you for tonight's update. Bye-bye now. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.